And well, here's a quick uh, wrap of the latest uh, other news, of course, on the election front. The Election Commission found that Niti Aayog Vice Chairman Rajiv Kumar's comments on the Congress's promise of minimum income guarantee scheme as a violation of the Model Code of Conduct and has asked him to exercise caution in the future. Kumar had accused the Congress of making the promise just to win the elections. He had also tweeted the proposed income guarantee scheme fails the economics test, fiscal discipline test and the execution test. The first vote of the Lok Sabha polls has been cast in Arunachal Pradesh. Service voters of the remote Indo-Tibetan Border Police Unit or the ITBP in the northeast voted through a secret postal ballot. A person enrolled in the armed forces and serving outside his or her state or a government employee stationed outside India can enroll as a service voter. The Commissioner of Police of Kolkata is among four top IPS officers in Bengal who have been replaced by the Election Commission ahead of the general election. The poll panel said the four officers cannot be deployed for any election-related duties. The announcement comes days after BGP leaders had alleged that free and fair elections would not be possible in the state under these officers. Additional Director General of Police Rajesh Kumar was made the new Kolkata top cop. Stepping up his attack on Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Congress President Rahul Gandhi alleged that the PM had insulted his political guru LK Advani. Rahul Gandhi alleged that the PM doesn't even greet or acknowledge Advani, one of BJP's founding members, at public meetings. Rahul Gandhi said, as per the Hindu tradition, a guru is considered supreme, deserves utmost respect and honor, but Modi had insulted Advani time and again. Actor Vivek Obroy, who is playing the role of Narendra Modi in an upcoming biopic on the Prime Minister, is on the list of the BJP star campaigners in Gujarat. The list also includes Modi, uh, includes Prime Minister Modi, the party chief Amit Shah, Union Minister Rajnath Singh, Nitin Gadkari, Shushma Swaraj, Arun Jaitley, actors Hema Malani and Paresh Rawal, who are BJP MPs, are also on the list. Polling for the upcoming Lok Sabha elections will be held in Gujarat on April 23rd.